knocking on the door, but no one wants to talk. Tonight, we went looking for the San Diego School Board trustee who was accepting illegal gifts instead of making the important decisions about your child's education. Tenders reporter Emily Valdez is live with why some are cheering tonight. Emily. Many people felt that Marnie Foster abused her power when she was a board member and even the president here at the San Diego Unified School District. And the next time she comes to this building, she will be carrying a box to clean out her second floor office. The former board president of the San Diego School District guilty. <laughs> Marnie Foster pleaded guilty to a misdemeanor charge of taking financial gifts over the legal limit. I just sat and I waited and um, this is what the results are. It's the, it's the fruit from the tree that you grew. Francine Maxwell's kids went to school in Marnie Foster's district. Foster under fire since 2014, when 10 News exposed allegations of Foster abusing her power, including causing a staff shakeup at her son's school when a counselor gave him a bad review. Well, it saddens me because you want to believe that everyone goes into this with an open mind and an open heart to serve. Foster resigned from the school board. A judge sentenced her to three years probation. She ordered her to pay nearly $3,500 in restitutions and do 120 hours of community service. Hi, Marty. It seems she's not talking. The new school board president, Michael McQuarrie, defended Foster. My heart goes out to Marty Foster and her family. Uh, it's got to be horrific. Well, I feel sad for them that they have to remember that the school board serves the children and the families. So you're supposed to take yourself out. It's not over though. So the counselor that gave Marnie Foster's son a bad review, she was suspended for nine days and she thinks it was retaliation. So she is suing the school district. That lawsuit is still pending. I'm live in University Heights, Emily Valdez, 10 News. Emily, thank you. And you wouldn't know it by that Foster is out by the school board's website. Right now, Foster is still listed at the school board president.